Every six years, Congress passes a large transportation bill that appropriates funds for highways, bridges, and the infrastructure of America. Last summer, they, they approved such a bill. As I looked over it, I noticed that Congress, this bill was for $284 billion. I said, that's a lot of money. Now, as I looked closer, I found some pretty interesting projects that were included within that bill. First, four and a half million dollars for shrimp research to go to the states of Alabama, Mississippi, Louisiana, Texas, and Arizona. Arizona? I'm from Arizona. We don't have shrimp in Arizona. I mean, as I thought about that, I'm like, yeah, poor scum, Bubba, they probably like this proposal. They're in Alabama, more shrimp. But in Arizona, we don't have popcorn shrimp, we don't have jumbo shrimp, we don't have shrimp on the cob. What a waste of our money. I mean, Arizona, we don't have shrimp. We don't even like shrimp in Arizona. That's why we live in the desert. <laughs> now, let me just explain how this works. What happens is probably two or three people in Arizona have some, some um, assets in a shrimping company. So they hire someone to go out to D.C. They go to the congressman <laughs> in D.C. Hey, congressman, we know you're running next year. This is what we need to do. You need money. You have to win. So what we'll do is we'll give you 20 grand. You can use it for your campaign. And all we need you to do is, end of this transport, transportation bill, just slide in this legislation that's going to give us a couple hundred grand to research about shrimp. Congressman says, sure, why not? You know, I need the money. Help me to get reelected. Let me give you another example. Three million dollars to produce a documentary about highways in Alaska. Who cares about highways in Alaska? It's dark the whole year. I mean, that, that documentary might even be worse than Brokeback Mountain. <laughs> now, let me give you a third example. $1.6 million for a waterfront walkway in the hometown of Frank Sinatra, Hobokan, New Jersey. Have you ever heard of Hobokan, New Jersey? I haven't. I know that if they gave me the $1.6 million, I could travel the world. And the one place I probably wouldn't go is Hobokan, New Jersey. <laughs> now, in 1987, a similar transportation bill was proposed. There was 121 of these pet projects for congressmen. Ronald Reagan said that is not acceptable. He vetoed the bill. 1990, 2005, the same bill, over 6,000 pet projects. It was signed into law. That is not acceptable. That is our tax dollars. That is, that is money that we could use on the economy. And it's being wasted. And it's going to continue to be wasted unless somebody does something about it. Whether it's you or whether it's me. But do something about it. Thank you.